According to a tweet by Arslan Zudosi dated July 5, 2023, Ukrainian forces were recently spotted with a Czech Polish OT-64 SKOT armored personnel carrier. The OT-64 SKOT, known for its versatility, is expected to contribute to the military operations of the Ukrainian forces. In the context of the Russo-Ukrainian war, Ukraine is actively seeking ways to strengthen its defense capabilities. The versatile nature of the OT-64 SKOT makes it suitable for various military operations, including troop transport, reconnaissance, and support missions. By expanding their armored fleet, Ukrainian forces are better equipped to effectively respond to current security threats. To date, there have been no official statements from the Czech Republic or Poland regarding the delivery of this type of vehicle to Ukraine. To our knowledge, the Ukrainian army did not have any of these vehicles before the start of the conflict. The OT-64 SKOT, a wheeled amphibious armored personnel carrier, is a true symbol of cooperation between Czechoslovakia and the People's Republic of Poland. With its origins dating back to the late 1950s, this versatile vehicle is still in service today. It was designed in 1959, and production began in 1963, continuing until the early 1970s. It was manufactured by Fabrika Samokodo Cieserowicz, FSC, in the People's Republic of Poland. In total, approximately 4,500 units of this vehicle were built. The OT-64 SKOT has a mass of 14.5 tons and measures 7.44 meters in length, 2.55 meters in width, and 2.71 meters in height. It can accommodate a crew of 2 and 18 passengers. Some models, such as the OT-64A and SKOT-2A, are designed to carry 10 additional passengers along with the crew. The vehicle is equipped with armor ranging from 6 to 13 mm in thickness, providing protection against small arms fire. In terms of armament, the OT-64 SKOT is equipped with a 7. 62 mm PKT machine gun and a 14.5 mm KPV machine gun. These weapons provide firepower to support the embarked troops during operations. The OT-64 SKOT is powered by an air-cooled Tatra T-928-14V8 diesel engine, producing 177 horsepower. This enables the vehicle to reach a maximum speed of 94 km per hour on land and 9 km per hour in water. With an operational range of 710 km, the OT-64 SKOT is capable of conducting long missions without refueling. Since its introduction in 1963, the OT-64 SKOT has been used in various conflicts around the world. It has been deployed during the Indo-Pakistani War of 1971, the Western Sahara War, the Iran-Iraq War, Operation Blue Star, and the Syrian Civil War. Its versatility, mobility, an amphibious capability have made it a popular choice for armed forces facing diverse operational scenarios. The addition of the OT-64 SKOT to the Ukrainian forces is not a significant development in the current war. However, questions arise regarding the origin of this vehicle, and several hypotheses have been suggested to explain its presence on the battlefield.